Hey everybody, Ian here at Able City in Burbank, and today we're checking out the Marshall V LCD 56MD monitor. This is a LCD panel with resolution of 1280 by 800. Uh, it is a 170 degrees angle of view, left to right, up and down. It's a modular design on the back here, and the idea is that we can swap out these different uh, modules, cold swap them, meaning that we have to power down the monitor before we take one out and put one in. Uh, and that helps us to route the signals as required uh, for a given job. The monitor comes with HDMI in and out as standard. Uh, however, you can purchase a separate module that will go to the HDMI output and give us dual HDSDI outputs in 3G. And that is a MDO 3G panel. Uh, the loop through or the HDMI output on this is actually scaled. And what I mean by that is on certain DSLRs, when you hit the record button, it actually changes the physical size of the image that we're viewing. Well, in the menus built into this monitor, it actually accounts for that and will resize it to uh, standard specifications, or you can set your own you know, custom setup. Powering the monitor is, requires a 12, 7 to 12 volts of power. There's a 5.5 millimeter uh, input jack on the side here. The monitor, when you purchase it, comes with a power supply. Uh, you can purchase separate uh, power cables to various types of battery systems, or you can purchase a plate uh, separately that goes onto the back here, and that will accommodate uh, all the major manufacturers' camcord camcorder batteries. In terms of the layout on the front here, uh, it's a very feature-rich menu in here, but there are four function buttons on the front panel, and really that's how you're going to navigate to the features you're going to use the most. And most likely, those features are going to involve focus and your exposure. And to that end, there's a couple different ways to evaluate both. In the focus, we have a pixel-to-pixel -pixel evaluation, and we also have a peaking capability. In the peaking function, there's five different colors you can choose from. You can also control the thickness of that peaking. In terms of exposure, there is a false color command, and they have included a uh, color bar on the side here, and the different colors correspond to different luminance values of IRE. So at a quickly, at a glance, you can tell where you are in terms of your key light, in terms of the exposure. In addition, you can also call up a waveform monitor. And the waveform monitor menu is nice because you can also call up a uh, audio as well. And it's a two-channel audio uh, graph, and it includes values. So if you're bringing a reference tone from a mixer to the camera, uh, you can see exactly where minus 20 is, for example. The menu navigation is quick, it's easy, and it's very feature-rich. The uh, weight of this monitor is one pound and uh, made of very tough uh, construction, and they have included quarter 20s on every single side of this monitor. So no matter how you have to rig it, there's a way to get it onto an arm. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again soon.